From affordable flagships to folding smartphones, there's no shortage of exciting upcoming phones for the next few months. Like to follow every smartphone launch like a hawk? Your diary must have been busy in 2022. From affordable blowers to fresh flagships to folding phones, the year has already yielded a whole host of shiny new handsets. But you're presumably here to stay on top of what's around the corner. So in this video, we're going to discuss the top 10 mobile phones in 2023. Keep watching to know about the interesting things that these top 10 phones offer. Number 10, iPhone 13 or iPhone 13 mini. Although the iPhone 14 is available, Apple still sells older models at a discount, and the iPhone 13 is one of the best iPhones Apple sells. Since Apple didn't release an iPhone 14 mini, the iPhone 13 mini is the only way to get the smallest size iPhone with the biggest features. Screen The iPhone 13 uses a 6.1 inch screen, and the iPhone 13 mini has a smaller 5.4 inch screen. Both displays are super sharp and bright enough to hit 1200 nits at maximum brightness. The iPhone 13 mini has a lower resolution, but packed in a smaller screen, it has a higher PPI density. Battery life. In our tests, the iPhone 13 lasted a day of use, but not much longer. That puts it in the pretty average territory, but it's still an improvement on many previous iPhones here. The iPhone 13 mini has a slightly smaller battery and may need to be charged before its bigger brother. Camera. Both the iPhone 13 and iPhone 13 mini have the same cameras. They lack telephoto zoom, but the main and ultra wide cameras work very well. The iPhone 13 gets Apple's sensor side image stabilization, a feature typically found on pro DSLR cameras. With plenty of shooting modes and features, there's a lot to play with here and a lot to like. Number nine, iPhone SE 2022 iPhones tend to be expensive, but the iPhone SE in 2022 gives Apple fans a cheaper ticket to owning the best phones they can buy. Apple recently gave this phone a solid update, using the same chips on the inside as the iPhone 14, making it a solid product for the low price. Screen This new iPhone SE has a 4.7-inch screen borrowed from the iPhone 7 and iPhone 8, making it larger than the original iPhone SE, but still easy to use with one hand. That has become important for people who demand a smaller phone, especially since there are no new iPhone 14 mini. Battery life As long as you're not a power user who would probably go for the iPhone 11 series anyway, you'll be fine with what Apple offers in terms of battery life. It won't last you more than a day, but even with 5G running all day and non-stop, you'll still be able to squeeze up to 12 hours of battery life. Camera For the money, the iPhone SE 2022 takes photos perfectly well in good light. You won't notice much of a difference outside of that, occasionally failing to achieve perfect exposure levels and depth of field outdoors during the day. Number 8. OnePlus 10 Pro The OnePlus 10 Pro is the best option for OnePlus fans. This fairly new version has a fantastic display, plenty of power under the hood, and fast charging capabilities. The best part is that it's more affordable than rival Pro phones. Display The phone's 6.7-inch 2K Fluid AMOLED display with a 120Hz refresh rate makes streaming TV shows, gaming, or devouring social media content a joy. That's especially thanks to its high maximum brightness of 1300 nits and the OnePlus's LTPO 2.0 technology for automatic refresh rate switching. The phone also supports 1 billion colors and HDR10+. Battery Life there's a big 5000 mAh battery here, but that bright and fast screen, not to mention a powerful processor, keeps battery life in the middle of the road. It should give you a full day of use though, and fast charging is available when you run out of battery. That 65 watt load, US only, should see you go from zero to full in no time. Camera Taking photos and videos is one of the OnePlus 10 Pro's greatest strengths, thanks to the trio of 48 megapixel f1.8 main, 50 megapixel f 2.2 ultra wide and 8 megapixel f 2.4 telephoto cameras for 3.3 optical zoom x which offers great performance your photos will come out bright vibrant detailed and even wide angle ones number seven iphone 14 
This year's iPhone 14 has last year's Apple A15 chip inside, but that chip was already powerful enough to run the best phones you can buy. It lacks the better cameras and display of the iPhone 14 Pro, but Apple's best-in-class support and service, along with a high future trade and value, make the iPhone 14 one of our top picks. Display The iPhone 14 uses a 6.1-inch OLED display with a resolution of 1170 by 2532. It is capable of a maximum brightness of 1200 nits. We like the smaller screen because it's easy to hold and Apple displays always look sharp and colorful. Battery life. Thanks to its smaller but well-optimized iOS 16 screen, the iPhone 14 has a fairly long-lasting battery despite being small. You can count on a day of use between charges, though more may be possible. Camera. The two rear cameras here don't give you much versatility, but the dynamic range and AI optimization make up for that to return pretty good images. Number 6. Google Pixel 7 The Google Pixel 7 benefits from the same Google Tensor G2 chipset found in the Pixel 7 Pro, our number 2 phone. That doesn't just mean it performs well as Google's best, it also means you get the blur photo, improved assistance, and other upcoming Google AI features that are exclusive to Tensor phones. Screen The Pixel 7 screen isn't quite as good as the Pixel 7 Pro's fantastic screen, but it's still very nice to use. It is a 6.3-inch OLED with a maximum brightness of 1400 nits. It has a resolution of 1080 by 2400 pixels with always-on capabilities unlike the iPhone 14. Battery life Battery life on the Pixel 7 was okay, and we got a full day of use out of the phone, but not much more than that. Inside, it has a 4355 mAh battery and is capable of charging up to 30 watts. Google says it can charge up to 50% in 30 minutes. There is also 20 watt wireless charging and you can reverse the wireless charging of other devices. Camera The Google Pixel 7 has the same main camera and ultra-wide macro lens that you'll find on the Pixel 7 Pro. Photos were fantastic with a 50 megapixel main lens and 12 megapixel ultra-wide though we missed having big telephoto capabilities. The Pixel 7 gets all the same photo editing and blurring magic as the Pixel 7 Pro thanks to the Tensor G2 chip. Number 5. Samsung Galaxy Z Flip 4 If we only care about style, the Samsung Galaxy Z Flip 4 would top this list of best phones. It's fully capable with a huge screen and great performance, but it just oozes style. Folding it closed and opening it feels like nothing else in the world of smartphones, and that experience deserves a high place on this list. Screen You won't believe that this compact foldable hides a huge 6.7-inch screen inside. The screen is bright enough, peaking at 1200 nits, with a resolution of 1080 by 2640. The small display on the cover is a 1.9-inch 260 by 512-bit OLED window for displaying notifications and giving you a viewer of a selfie camera with the main camera. Battery Life The Galaxy Z Flip 4's battery life was a bit disappointing, as the foldable shape and slim design preclude a massive battery inside. You get a 3700 mAh cell, and it only charges at 25 watts. We get a full day of use, but cut things out late at night. Camera The Galaxy Z Flip 4's cameras are disappointingly simple, with just two 12-megapixel shooters on the rear, but it's got a secret weapon. The main lens uses very large pixels on the sensor, so the shots are better than you might expect. You can also point that main camera directly at your face using the cover screen as a viewfinder. So instead of the 10-megapixel selfie camera, you can use the full main cameras for selfies. Number 4 Samsung Galaxy A53 Samsung's Galaxy S phones represent the best cutting-edge phones around, but today we need a phone that gives us the most features for the least amount of money, and the Galaxy A53 is the best budget phone you can buy. Between the advanced cameras, large screen, and premium design, the Galaxy A53 is an easy phone to recommend. Display The A53 has an attractive display, with the same resolution and refresh rate as the S22. Size aside, most people probably won't notice a huge difference between this budget phone screen and the S22s. If you care about specs, you'll get a 6.5-inch panel with an FHD Plus resolution, a 120Hz refresh rate, and 800 nits peak brightness. Battery life 
The Samsung Galaxy A53 has a 5000 mAh battery life, which is useful as it has 5G connectivity and a bright screen. We found the phone to last about a day between charges, slightly less with more use. The only downside here is that it takes over two hours to get a full charge. Camera the A53 boasts some pretty impressive photo-taking prowess. It has a 64-megapixel f1.8 main camera, joined by a 12-megapixel f2.2 ultra-wide lens, a 5-megapixel f2.4 macro, and a 5-megapixel f2.4 depth sensor. There are much more expensive phones with fewer camera options. Number 3. Google Pixel 7 Pro The Google Pixel 7 Pro isn't just the best Pixel, it's one of the best phones you can buy. Google improves many of the basics, which the promise of more to come. Android finally feels like a mature and thoughtful system that's easy to use, and the Pixel 7 Pro does a lot of the legwork for you on every task. Screen Google Pixel 7 Pro uses a fantastic 6.7-inch screen. Like the iPhone 14 Pro, it uses LTPO OLED technology, so it can always stay on without using up a lot of battery. It has a 1440 by 3120 resolution with 512 ppi, which is even sharper than the iPhone or Galaxy S22 Ultra. It can reach a maximum brightness of 1500 nits. Battery Life The Pixel 7 Pro uses a 5000 mAh battery as big as any of our best phones and can last a full day in our tests, but not more than that. It charges at 30 watts, which is slower than we'd like. You can wirelessly charge it up to 23 watts and you can even reverse the power to wirelessly charge other devices. Camera There are three cameras on the back of the Google Pixel 7 Pro. A 50 megapixel f1.9 main camera, a 48 megapixel f3.5 telephoto lens with 5x zoom, and a 12 megapixel f2.2 ultra wide lens with pixel sensors larger, capable of macro photography. The real photo magic happens in software, as the Pixel 7 Pro can use Google Photos to blur your old pictures, even the photos the Pixel didn't take. Number 2. Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra The Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra was our number one phone, but with a starting price well above any other phone on our list, we have to wonder if it does too much. It is packed with powerful features, and the design is superlative. Still. We don't have the extra money to buy a phone that's better than the best, if that's way more than we need. Display The Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra has a 6.8-inch 1440x3088 AMOLED display with a 120Hz refresh rate and a super high 1750 nits peak brightness. By all accounts, this is one of the best displays you'll find on a smartphone. Battery Life the Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra has a large 5000 mAh battery, and we found that it would generally last a full day no matter how you use the phone. It also supports 45 watts fast charging, though note that there is no charger in the box. Camera The Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra has the beefiest camera setup you'll find on this list. It has a 108 megapixel main camera, a 12 megapixel ultra wide angle, a 10 megapixel 2x zoom, and a 10 megapixel 10x zoom with true optical zoom. It also wields incredible digital magic to stabilize long zoom images and improve quality, making even 100x zoom photos worth sharing. Number 1. iPhone 14 Pro and Pro Max Why it ranks first? Apple's iPhone 14 Pro is the most intuitive and well-designed smartphone, packed with all the features we'd want. Apple's ongoing service and support with a high trade-in value make this our top pick. Display iPhone 14 Pro has the brightest display of any smartphone, capable of up to 2,000 nits outdoors. It's super sharp and very fast, with a 120Hz refresh rate. Instead of the familiar notch, Apple now uses a punch hole for the cameras it calls Dynamic Island. Battery Life The iPhone 14 Pro has a bigger battery than its predecessor, but we can't say that battery life has improved significantly, and we wonder if Apple's iOS is to blame. We hope to see improvements in future OS updates. Camera the Apple iPhone 14 Pro Max has the highest resolution camera on any iPhone, as well as a 3x optical zoom camera and an ultra-wide camera that can handle macro photography. Shooting is very easy and automated. That's all for today. Do you agree with our top 10 list? Let us know your opinion in the comments section below. Stay safe and we will be back soon with another video.